tomorrow and is in tomorrow, which is gonna be like four hours from now. Uh, we're heading over to Custom Offsets and they are going to be building our truck, which has been long overdue. So we're doing a collab with them. It's gonna be sick. Um, they're gonna show us around. Yeah, sorry that Ben wasn't talking, you guys. He gets really cranky when he's tired. Yeah, he didn't get his nap today. Wow, this is sick. That's pretty, pretty decent lobby going by. Not bad. No one here to greet us though. Yeah, yeah what the f Fitness center. Oh, Micah. CJ. Micah. They hooked us up with two hotel rooms. Yeah. They, they so we're, really we're not sharing any beds. Yeah. Dude, the one trip Ken doesn't go on. He would have loved yeah, this. He no. They're not cheaping out on us here. Yeah, hey, CJ. Go. Good luck sleeping with Stor Snores McGee. <laughs> oh, it's a one bed, Ryan. Is it really? It is. It's a one bed. <laughs> No wonder we needed two rooms. Yeah. Uh, on Sunday, this guy showed up to Ryan's dad's shop and left the baddest burnout marks every everywhere. And now Ryan is like, I gotta get that off somehow. Dude, it's not coming off. It's permanent. I think no, you just need not. to turn into asphalt. That bed looks amazing, and that couch looks not amazing. Dude, Michael Mike loves the couch. Oh, dude. Say the joke. <laughs> Can I just use someone else? Like, my say it, say it. pulls out, but my buddy Jake doesn't. <laughs> that was the joke. That's the joke. It's the dumb, the, the pull out joke. My coach pulls out, but I don't. Yes, that, that's the joke. Wow. All right, everybody, we'll see you in the morning when CJ's less tired and I'm less tired and Micah has had a good night's sleep on this couch. Fine couch. Well, it seems a little bit bigger than ours. She's pretty giant. Hey, good Micah. to meet you. You too, Bullard. man. You too. Dude, what if this was a setup that we were running? I, dude, this is an 8-inch. This is an 8-inch? It looks amazing, though. Dude, oh my god, it looks incredible. Really knows how to make our truck look like a piece. No yeah. way! No. What? Okay. Uh, pulled a couple strings. That is literally my dream car. Yeah. I'm Alex. Yeah. No yeah. way. Nice Sorry, man. I'm bad. Uh, CJ. CJ, nice to meet you, man. So funny. All right, real quick. You guys are probably wondering, what are we doing in Appleton, Wisconsin? Well, if you notice, our truck, although we got it wrapped, it looks a little unfinished. So that's when a really cool company called Custom Offsets is coming in. They're putting rims, tires, and a lift on our truck and it's gonna look amazing when it's done. So that's what we're doing all week while we're here. So they surprised us with this Porsche GT3 and this mega F350. And uh, I think I think we got some other surprises for the week. So pretty excited. Stay tuned. You're in for, you're in for a treat. We're gonna go the speed limit the entire time. Of course. are just rolling up. Welcome. You're home for oh the next four days. Oh my gosh. So this is the home of the actual shop. This is where you'll actually be hanging out with Fuller and the rest of you guys. We'll have the truck on the lift here for you. We'll be doing all the build stuff. Watch me get up in this. This is, this is what you gotta do. <laughs> like you literally, it's like a pull up. Oh my gosh. You're gonna hurt my back hopping in out of that thing. <laughs> Every single one of these vehicles is an employee's vehicle, which is really cool because obviously they have really good taste in, uh, in cars and trucks.
This is literally the coolest thing I've ever seen yeah, in my entire life. Says, makes me want to leave right now and get to work. Like when it comes to the <laughs> yeah. offices, this is like, yeah, this is the way to do it. it. Literally everything that I do day to day and each one of us do day to day, just like in a room, like, hey, you do this, you do that, you do that. And like the efficiency, I can't even imagine. You want to go fast, go by yourself. You want to go far, build a team. So anyways, uh, we are going to hop in the truck, probably burn the tires off we find a good spot. We are going to get some walk around shots here with Cody and then uh, I think we're gonna do the burnout right here. This is literally the perfect spot. I can't believe I got to be the one that gets to do this. CJ, jerk the brake a little bit. That's Dude, not bad. That was fun. How'd it feel? Felt good. Hey, we got a problem. What? We got a little bit of meat left. What? <laughs> oh, shoot. That is a problem. No. <laughs> it would be way louder. Yeah. Now that is a proper way to get rid of your tires. Uh, Dude, they're that. slicks now. Straight up. Go back to the shop, um, put the fronts and the backs, and then come back here, do the same, and then let's <laughs> All right, we got a little bit of a care package here. Didn't realize they had 130 employees, so we're a little <laughs> short on stuff. We'll see who's the most deserving. Yeah, exactly. So it's day two. Feminine Industries is picking us up in about two minutes. All right, I'm assuming this is our ride. Right. Morning, boys. Morning. Morning. How's it going? Hey, guys. This thing is so cool. So cool. So sick. Clean culture. There's only one seat? Yeah. yeah exactly. No back? Dude, that is what I'm talking about. Like, that's what you do. <laughs> <laughs> then you don't have to worry about people asking for rides. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Wow. This is definitely the sickest. <laughs> Focus ST I've ever been in. <laughs> Thanks, man. I appreciate this, it. This trumps all RSs, too. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. All right. I'll take that as a big compliment. Uh, it has full bolt ons. It's on air ride. Uh, VIP modular three piece wheels. It's a fun car. I've had a, yeah, a good dude. time with it. How much horsepower to the wheels? Um, so it's probably like 280 to the wheels, which nice. isn't that great. It's not but it makes close to 400 torque, which wow. is where like, it, it gets real fun. Yeah. This is a serious. Serious car. <laughs> I would I would definitely call this a race car. Spent way too much money on it. I believe it. I, man. Man. I believe it. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? Tell them what just happened. They grab us from lunch and they're like, hey C boys, we've got a surprise for you. And we're like walking back, like, mmm, Lambo. What's up? GT3 RS. Ooh. No, your truck is actually, you guys are actually lucky you made it here without the wheels falling off. And we're like, uh, excuse me, what? How does, how does this happen? Ex explain, somebody. Uh, it's uh, probably some sort of vibration that popped it off of there initially, but basically they got sheared off. So your uh, wheel was held on by like two threads on each of those. Just to top it off, we got a bad CV axle up in the front. So a little bit bad news, but on the bright side, we're gonna have some new studs and uh, New axle, new axle. It'll be good to go. Yeah. yeah. So this is Sean, and he's the owner of this event door. And Sean is gonna be nice enough to give us a ride in it today. She looks fast, but we're not gonna go fast because this is my baby. We're gonna just enjoy the moment and stay in the speed limit.
dirty. So I don't know what you know about these. They have a clutch. I just don't operate it. The car does. Okay. Really? So I use the paddle shifts. There's no pedal. The car runs it and you'll hear it. Yeah. And it'll engage and disengage faster than any human can. Yeah. So I use the paddle shifters and that's what triggers the clutch. Yeah. It'll also dump the throttle so I can stay full throttle shift and it'll dump the throttle, the throttle run the clutch and just keep going. Really? Yeah. And then it's got your Strata, your Sport, your Corsa. This is basically how much control the car will have. Yep. This is the car will make sure you don't hit a curb. Yep. This is the car shouldn't hit a curb. Okay. This is the car's going to hit a curb. Okay. <laughs> so I go Which one are we going? Go We're going the in the middle? Yep. All right, man, they don't give you much uh, space to see out of this, do they? No, you, you basically drive and listen for crunching. People always ask, how can you see? And I said, I don't, I just listen. <laughs> how often do you drive this? Uh, a couple times a week. I kind of daily drive it, just if I have short distances, it's not wait worth waiting 15 minutes for it to warm up. Right. Thanks again, Sean. Hey, buddy. Appreciate it. Oh. Woo! Good luck. Just borrow it for the month. Yeah, go ahead, take it. <laughs> I love yeah. it. I love it. I love it. So much, I love it. off out there i don't even know how you describe it it's like the shifter cart but like 10 times as big yeah it's violent but you also feel really safe unfortunately yeah. you're in a cockpit dude yeah, you're just like in Literally. it it's amazing yeah is it on <laughs> dude we hit the interstate i think we did uh, totally legal speed, but we got there so fast. I was like, whoa. With the kids hanging out the cars. Like, right? They're like, yeah. This is a little more of a family sedan. Yeah. Yeah. We, got, we got the here. whole family here. I feel like I'm David Dobrik. Yeah, yeah that's what I said. Dude, look at how far the glass comes up. So cool. <laughs> Dude. The fact that I literally the just torque. Yeah. I just got a Lambo and this still feels Yeah, bad. literally. <laughs> the, the kids would be sad if I didn't show you their favorite feature about this car. Whoopee cushion mode. <laughs> <laughs> so you can choose who farts. <laughs> ben! No way! That's hilarious. That's amazing. <laughs> Whose idea was that? It had to, it had to have been a child. Yeah. Or adult with a child ah. sense of humor. <laughs> That was a good rip. Uh, <laughs> pretty realistic too. Whoa. He opened the door for me. Like fan style. If there was a car on that yellow line, it would still open. The only time it's that, Ryan? ever not is when... Bougie. What's up, guys? What's up? What's up? Nice shirt, my guy. Yeah. Dude, look at this crowd right now. Yeah, this is a squad. Usually we don't have this for a peanut. Oh. What the fuck? That was amazing. <laughs> Holy shit. God. 
<laughs> How'd that one feel? Good. Felt okay. good. Felt good. A little bit, but it, it feels like another one yet, so we're good. So Damn. is that your car? No, he bought that for 200 bucks. Oh. <laughs> He's like jumping. His dad's jumping his car. <laughs> Wait, is your dad? Yeah. I Amazing. Yeah, the boys are coming over. Can I borrow your car for the night? <laughs> That's your car? No. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, man, he doesn't get to go back to school now. He's, got <laughs> he's riding his bike now. He's going again. He just opened the hatch because he couldn't see, but he's like, yeah, basically just going to pedal to the floor and reverse it right through here. Why not? <laughs> oh! oh! <laughs> That's like Jake when he's older. <laughs> Hey, I gotta say, I we're impressed. Dude, holy <laughs> <is> really <laughs> impressed. Amazing. I'm like, <laughs> you know, I I thought it was great the first time you hit it, and then when you did it in reverse, I was I was twice as impressed. <laughs> yeah, twice as impressed. I was just concentrating on hitting it. <laughs> wow. He's so focused on where he's going that he wasn't focused on how fast he was going. Yeah. Oh shit. He gets out and goes, I need a chiropractor. Is this like you're used to this type of stuff? Yeah. This happens every Wednesday. Every Wednesday. Yep. For the next couple months now. <laughs> so you. Do you do you want to take after your dad and jump cars? I mean, eventually, yeah. Oh, you just when you're old enough. Yeah. Old enough, yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> Welcome to Custom Offset. I didn't expect to see that. I thought you guys were expecting us to get in the car and jump in. I thought you guys were gonna be like corporate and just like, you know, treat us like outsiders. No. Not yeah. Dude, you guys took all. us in. Uh, welcome to the fam. Thank you. Know. All right, guys, that's the end of part one of a two part series of our truck build. Tune back in next Monday to see the final reveal because it turned out so sick. Also, you guys, we did collab on a few videos with them. So we're going to have those linked down below as well as their website. So if you're looking for any parts, go check that out. Until then, we will see you next Monday. Peace out. For the record, don't try to make y'all comfortable. For the record, you ain't trying to quote any stuff for you. Are you ready?